Do you guys understand why I didn't want to marry this guy? Are you gonna say anything? Uh, I'm sorry that, that I didn't believe you. I should have believed my own daughter than listened to your father. Why did you think I would lie about this? You've just gone out of the teenage years. You could possibly lie about something like this. What would I have gained to lie about something this serious? When I was outside with Julian, he threatened me. You guys didn't see the fear in my eyes. I know. And I am so sorry. Once your father gets home, both you and I are going to go talk to him because there is no way I am letting some abusive asshole marry my daughter. Thank you, Mom. I love you. I love you too. Basically, to sum it up, I was treating your daughter as a normal person. Then Bianca decides to be extremely rude to me and said a bunch of lies toward me. Mrs. Floor came into the room and was very confused, so she believed Bianca. I tried to explain, but then your wife decided to yell and kick me out. Oh, I swear to God, these two are going to give me a fucking aneurysm. I wanted to give you the rundown before your wife and daughter tell you their side of the story. I'm sorry you have to hear this from me, George. It's not your fault, Julian. I'm going to have a long talk with these two. Thank you for letting me know. Of course. You will never win, Bianca. I always get what I want. What do you want? Don't give me that, young man. I need you to come down to the office. It's important. Ugh, fine. I'll be there around 20 minutes. Leaving so soon? Yeah, something happened at home, so I'm being needed. Oh, I hope everything's okay. Remember, the wedding is on hold. Yes, I'm aware. Thank you. <laughs> Not a problem. Have a good night, George. Why did you call me here, Dad? What happened at Bianca's house? Why is it any of your business? I am your fucking father, Julian. You still need to listen to me. <laughs> I don't need to tell you everything. Listen to me, Julian. If you want to take over this company and marry Bianca, you must continue to listen and answer me, understand? If mom was here, she wouldn't have allowed me to take over this business. Do you remember when you shot and killed your mother? <laughs> One of the worst days of my entire life. <laughs> she was the one who got herself put into this mess. 
had she just let me do what I needed to do with you, she would still be alive. How fucking dare you threaten to leave me? I am not gonna be a goddamn pawn in the shit that you do anymore, Isaiah. I'm done! Ma ma mama Julian! Get the fuck out under the bed now! Where, where's Ma? She's gone to your grandmother's house. Do it! Fucking do it! If you don't fucking do it, you'll join them! Do it! <laughs> Beautiful work, my son. Well done. You fucking did this to me, you fucking piece of shit. <laughs> Since you were the one who killed your mother, I'm scot free. Mom didn't deserve that. Why the fuck did you force me to do this? I forced you to kill her because she was holding you back. I had to do what was needed to be done. <laughs> you don't have the balls, Julian. Even if you do, people are going to get suspicious. Weren't people already suspicious when you killed mom? Oh, no, 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 no. You were the one that killed her. It was done by your hands. Someone had to kill her, and I, it wasn't gonna be me. I am not afraid on pulling this trigger, Julian. If you do this one more time, you will be going straight to hell with your mother. Do you understand? Now, are you going to tell me what truly happened at Bianca's house? When me and Bianca were in her room, Lucy is onto us. 
I tried to explain, but she immediately kicked me out of her house. Ugh. Let me worry about that. You just worry about Bianca getting away from her mom. You're free to go. I'm sorry, Mom. I would have died with you if Dad had never forced me to do this. Are you fucking serious? George, calm down. I'm not going to calm down. You kicked Julian out of our house for a stupid reason? Did Julian tell you the real reason? <laughs> he has told me that both you and Julian were just hanging out. And Lucy decided to be very rude to him and kick him out for no reason. That is not the reason why I kicked him out, George. Then what was the reason, Lucy? Tell me. I would love to hear it. When I went upstairs to check on both Bianca and Julian, Julian was threatening to Bianca about having Angela's son's head at the front door. He would never do that. Julian is such a great kid. Dad, would you want me to marry an abuser? You are just making this up so you won't have to marry him. Why would I make this up, George? Julian said to Bianca that she doesn't know what he had to do to get to this moment. Doesn't that sound suspicious? I don't want to believe it. Do you trust your own wife of almost 20 years? Or do you trust your boss? Well, I guess we know the answer. You trust your own boss than you do your family. No, I don't. I trust you, Bianca. I'm sorry for not believing you. I wish I knew better, but getting both you and Julian was all I could ever think of. I just wanted you to have someone to care for you, so you won't have to work that day in your life. You were looking out for me, and I appreciate that a lot. But my heart goes to the one person, and that person only. And that person is Jack. I think both me and your father will discuss about you dating that boy again. But for now, your father needs to talk to Isaiah to cancel the wedding. I love you, Dad. I love you too, Bianca. We're not going to let you go, Bianca. That is the last thing we'll do. Dad? Where are you going? <sighs> I'm going to talk to Isaiah. I'm stopping this wedding once and for all. Is something on your mind, Angela? I just can't believe that these guys are going to risk their lives on saving Bianca. It's a risk that they're willing to take. The people that are running Owlgate are one of the most dangerous people out there. Hopefully, there will be some good at the end. Alright, alright, you guys. You've had enough training for tonight. Tomorrow, we're going to continue, and we will not stop until we save Bianca. <sighs> I... I really hope that this is worth it. <sighs> it will be. It has to be. Come on, you guys. You need your rest. Let's hope you guys are ready for that day to come. When the day comes, it's when everything changes. Don't worry, Bianca. We're coming to save you. Hold on while you can.